Tuesday, the Grand Island Area Chamber of Commerce Agriculture Committee held an agricultural day at Farmer Park. Students got to see animals up close, talk about corn and soybeans, and many other activities throughout the day. Northwest senior Jillian Dixon said it's important to show young students where their food comes from. I feel that it's important for our FFA chapter to come out and show the fourth graders about the animals and the livestock because if they don't know where their food comes from, then they're just going to be as ignorant as a lot of other people actually around in this country and they need to know how they're getting fed and how to feed the animals and that a cow is not a goat. They need to know the difference, especially with the different meats and the different ways that it can be used. Nebraska Corn Board Director of Communications Emily Thornburg said for the Corn Board it's important to show students the different types of corn. It's really important, especially in this kind of setting, more of a urban setting where students are removed from the farm to bring them here and expose them to agriculture and help bring that connection back to them. So for us personally, for the corn board perspective, it's helped them understand that there's a difference between field corn and sweet corn and popcorn's a type of corn. Thornburg said students seem to be having fun. First of all, I've heard that it's a lot of fun. Um, there's some live animals here today. Some of them have never seen a cow up close or a chicken up close. So that's really exciting for them to see that connection. And then I think they're just learning a lot about the broad spectrum of agriculture. For us especially, we're playing corn bingo. And a lot of them didn't know very much about corn, especially the sweet corn and the field corn thing. And so um, that's kind of a fun thing that they're walking away with. And they didn't realize that the corn they see in the field a lot of times is field corn rather than sweet corn. Dixon would like to see Agricultural Day expanded to more than just the fourth graders. I think that instead of just fourth graders, I think that we should have more grades coming out too. Yeah, it's good for the fourth graders because they're starting to learn about everything, but if you just come and hit it once and then not anymore, whereas it, a lot of people don't have that chance for an ag program as FFA is the only, only uh, FFA chapter in Grand Island. So we have a very good community and we need to teach about agriculture because Nebraska is a huge agricultural state and if we lose that, we're not The program was not around when Dixon was a fourth grader, but she thinks it would have been beneficial to have gone through agricultural day when her class was younger. I feel like a lot more of us would be into the agriculture instead of agriculture lacking a bunch of people like ag teachers and different stuff like that. I feel like a lot more of us would be into this field because yes baby animals are cute but you I think it's fun when you get to watch them grow and when you're that farmer that gets to watch them grow and yeah it's kind of sad that they go to the butcher but it's the process of life. So I think as my grade if we would have came through here then I think we would have a lot more vets, a lot more agricultural related people and I feel we do have a very strong tie to our uh, Hall County Fair and I feel like we would have a lot more people showing. We're kind of dwindling in numbers but the people that do it love what they do. Reporting from Fauner Park, I'm Zach Mayhew.